battle line is drawn as Bwari deploys soldiers and police to stop anyone trying to get Namikano out of detention by force. My dear people, Bwari is using his own hand to gradually drag himself to detention. Yes, and I'm very sure, very, very sure and more than sure that it will end up in shame. It will end up in shame. If care is not taken, if care is not taken, I bet you, Bwari will dance a dance of shame. And I'm very sure that he will not want that. <laughs> Uh, well, are they? Uh, my dear people, you can now see what has just been done right now by Mr. President. You can now see what Mr. President is now gradually using his own hand to cause for himself, which I believe is going to be a very big disgrace if uh, it, it breaks out. Deploying soldiers and mobile police to stop anyone trying to release an Americano out of detention. All right, let's see how it goes and uh, what is going to happen at the end of the day. All right, this is Evening News. The federal government has sent armed soldiers and mobile police officers to stop anyone trying to rescue an Americano out of detention. The gridlock, which began as early as last year is now a year plus now upon this mr president has challenged anyone who tried to release an Kanu, claiming that the person will be detained not minding the threats from the senate the wic the un or any other body president mobari has claimed that he will challenge anyone facially if they try to get Namdekano out by force, the law supersedes every other body. Nigeria have a law, and that law must be obeyed. The law has not released Namdekano as far as I'm concerned. The decision made is only a decision by the court and not a decision by the law of Nigeria. The Constitution has stated it clearly that Namdekano is accused of terrorism charges. Justice Nyako actually passed a judgment of fear, and that is why till this moment I have not allowed him to be released. I dare or challenge anyone to get Namdekano out of detention by force. Then Nigeria will see the other side of me, Barry claims. Look at. Look at. Please. Can anyone tell me if Wari actually understands the law? Does he really understand the law? Does Wari really understand the law? Because to me, he doesn't. Because to me, Wari only understands, uh, understands, uh, well, how will I put it? What Wari understands is just war. It's just war, and that is why today he's been tagged as one of the finest soldiers who actually fought during the war. Because he massacred, he killed, he shed blood of innocent Biafrans. Oh my God, my dear listeners. If you know Bwari in 1967, you will not even want to look at him for the second time. Then you will understand why people said no to him when he was coming in. You understand? Are we to talk about when he was a military leader? Are we to talk about that? He was not even elected. He only succeeded um, a, 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 a dead leader. The president, as a dead, died. So Bwari succeeded him and became president. And you need to see how he ruled Nigeria. And the same military spirit is what he is now trying to inflict on Nigeria even in this civilian system of government. My dear people, we must not give in to the streets. We must say no 
to to worry system of government look at everybody is just lamenting everybody are just crying saying what is this what have we done to ourselves oh my god my dear people in the house i tell you president morbury is making a mess of everything okay as if um as if it's going to be well okay everybody is believing that if this person talk to him he will listen if this person talk to him he will listen even the united nation the father of all nation spoke to president mobari still yet he kept his head down say no way say what no way you can imagine so my dear people you can see the length at which mr president can be unfair to the people you can see the level so let us just call a spade a spade and you know and face the truth of this matter president mobari is as as taking this very trial of mazin and the kind of person and i and i think the time has come for the uk the american and the, the and, and the other international body to come in into this matter and if possible get them they cannot out by themselves you understand because this man as i'm looking at is not ready to do anything it's not ready to do anything you understand and that's just it all right um let's hear you and let's know what your take and what's your opinion on what has just been reviewed maybe don't forget to leave them below the comment section click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you